I'm glad you're here, and I'm glad you're still angry on behalf of all of us. <laughs> because we, we, we have a favor to ask you, is that uh, we asked our Twitter followers uh, this past week if, who have roommates, and if they're angry at their roommate, and they don't know how to say how angry they are or what they're angry about, mm -hmm. and that we would have you get angry at their roommate for them. Oh, okay. Right? So I've, I've got a few tweets right here, and I'll sure. explain to you. I'll read you what the tweet okay. is. And you tell me, uh, and you tell me, and you, perhaps you, you answer on behalf of this person. Are you okay with that? Oh, absolutely. Okay, so this first one, this first and one. This could be a whole new living. Okay. I could do this At every week. I could do this every week. This is from Krista. <laughs> this is from Krista Timmerman. This is Krista Timmerman, okay. Uh, she says, a former roommate acquired a secret cat and kept it in his bedroom like it wasn't going to make noise or something. Lewis? Hey! Krista's roommate, you stuck a cat into your bedroom and kept it there, thinking no one would notice the hissing and the scratching? What were you going to tell them? Sorry, I just have my TV tuned to the Imprisoned Cat channel. <laughs> if cats really do have nine lives, I hope that cat comes back eight more times and craps on your head. All right, good, good. This is from uh, Melly Ann at Colbert Late Show. He texts me, my, my roommate texts me from the bathroom and asks me to bring him toilet paper. <laughs> Lewis? Listen up, buddy. Do not text your roommate saying you're on the toilet. We know everybody does it, but we've agreed to pretend it's not happening. <laughs> Secondly, if you want toilet paper, just post something on Tinder saying, Squatting loner with no social skills looking for toilet paper daddy. If you find a match, you're meant for each other. Oh. <laughs> and finally, this is from uh, Rachel Tillman at Colbert Late Show. I walked in on uh, uh, her. She walked in. Sorry, one second. Let me say this one more time. Anyway, my roommate, or... my roommate walked her boyfriend around on a leash like a dog. I wish I was kidding. Arr, arr. <laughs> wow, Rachel, that is disgusting of you <laughs> to judge two consenting adults. If I'm concerned for anyone, it's this poor dog walker who has to deal with having a 17th century Puritan for a roommate. <laughs> You've got nothing to complain about unless he starts humping your leg. And if he does that, just hit him with a newspaper. <laughs> Word of warning, he's gonna like it. <laughs>